This is a new boxing complex in Accra's Bokum region. Boxing fans have turned up in their hundreds to cheer one of their own. This man, Isaac Dogbo, the 2012 Olympic Games finalist. He's fighting Mexican opponent Cesar Juarez for the WBO interim super bantamweight title. And no one wanted to miss out on the action. The moment they'd been waiting for came sooner than expected. It's what the fans had paid to see. There were, however, concerns that the referee would favor the Ghanaian. The referee is not coming from Ghana. The referee is coming from the United States of America. That's Tony Wicks. And he's a very good referee. If you know him, he's a very good referee that we all know. So he's not going to be biased. It's what they have learned at training. It's what they are coming to showcase here. And with this, it was game over for the Mexican challenger. It's this kind of celebratory sense that the country once replicated worldwide. Once again, we are reviving Boston. Boston over the years has produced more world champions for this country. And for me, I'm happy that during my time, we are going to once again produce more world champions, world titles. So that's all that we are interested in. Ghana needs to uh, bounce back in boxing. Many, many box boxers have done it, and now it's Isaac Dogbe's turn, you know, to take the to take the baton to the next level. Guess what? There are a lot of talents coming out in Ghana. In the next few years, you're gonna see Ghana box. In the next few, you're gonna see a lot of talents. You know, you, I'm sh I can I can guarantee you that you see ten champions on a stretch. You know, Ghana boxing is back on the world map. Isaac Dogbo has now turned pro and will not be returning to the Olympic Games. But his victory has united the nation in celebration, something that many hope will become a regular occurrence for the West African nation. This title bout involving one of Ghana's renowned pugilists is a solid demonstration of popularity of boxing in this country. And now the country wants to use this momentum to build on their 2020 Olympic ambitions in Japan. Sadiq Shaban, CGTN in Bokum, Ghana.